Raytheon Laser Raytheon Technologies is at the forefront of high-energy laser systems that use photons, or particles of light, to carry out military missions and civil defense. These directed energy technologies are capable of detecting threats, tracking during maneuvers, and positively identifying a wide range of threats, including unmanned aerial systems, rockets, artillery, and mortars. One of their notable achievements is the Directed Energy Maneuver Short Range Air Defense, DEM Shorad, a 50 kilowatt class laser mounted on a U.S. Army Striker vehicle. This combat-capable weapon system was on track for operational fielding in 2022. It is the first 10 kilowatt class laser built to U.S. military specifications in a standalone configuration. This laser can be moved and mounted anywhere it's needed for counter drone missions. Drone Gun Tactica The Drone Gun Tactical is a highly effective countermeasure against a wide range of drone threats. It's designed for two-hand operation and long-range defeat. The device disrupts the radio frequency channels used to communicate and navigate drones, causing them to either land on the spot or return to their starting point. It's capable of disrupting multiple RF frequency bands simultaneously, and it immediately ceases video transmission back to the drone operator. The Drone Gun Tactical is lightweight, robust, and features an intuitive control panel user interface. It's also portable, making it easy to carry and use. This device is currently only available to the United States government and its agencies. Bell 360 the Bell 360 Invictus is a revolutionary attack reconnaissance aircraft designed to enhance the Ground Maneuver Commander's mission and fulfill the U.S. Army's Future Attack Reconnaissance Aircraft FARA, initiative. It boasts advanced speed, range, and agility, making it versatile for operations in any environment. The Bell 360 Invictus supports a 20mm cannon and an internal payload that features a modular effects launcher to accommodate current and future ordnance. The aircraft also features a supplemental power unit, SPU, that provides auxiliary power for ground maintenance and systems checks, and offers supplemental horsepower to boost cruise airspeed, dash speed, hover payload, and autorotative performance. The Bell 360 Invictus uses a proven fly-by-wire system, offering an upgrade path to higher-level capabilities, such as optimally crewed flight operations. F-15 Eagle the McDonnell Douglas F-15 Eagle, now part of Boeing, is an American twin-engine, all-weather tactical fighter aircraft. It was designed in the late 1960s to meet the United States Air Force's need for a dedicated air superiority fighter. The F-15 Eagle first flew in July 1972 and entered service in 1976. It is among the most successful modern fighters, with over 100 victories and no losses in aerial combat, with the majority of the kills by the Israeli Air Force. The F-15 has been exported to many countries including Israel, Japan, and Saudi Arabia. Although originally envisioned as a pure air superiority fighter, its design included a secondary ground attack capability that was largely unused. The F-15E Strike Eagle is expected to continue operating in the USAF into the 2030s. Vapor 55MX The Vapor 55MX is a next-generation all-electric helicopter unmanned aircraft system, UAS, designed by Aerovironment Incorporated. It's built for heavier payloads and longer distances, making it highly versatile for defense, commercial, and industrial applications. The Vapor 55MX can carry up to 24 pounds of usable payloads and has a flight endurance of up to 105 minutes with a third battery option. The system is equipped with a modular payload bay that can accommodate a wide range of sensors, including gimbal eo ir multispectral, LIDAR, comms relay, SIGINT, and armed VTOL, as well as a drop-slash-delivery mechanism. This makes it adaptable to multi-sensor, multi-mission requirements, including utility inspection, aerial surveying, public safety, and defense applications. B-2 Spirit Stealth Bomber 
The Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit, also known as the Stealth Bomber, is a marvel of modern aviation technology. This American heavy strategic bomber, featuring low observable stealth technology, is designed to penetrate dense anti-aircraft defenses. As a subsonic flying wing with a crew of two, the B-2 Spirit was produced from 1987 to 2000. It can drop both conventional and thermonuclear weapons, such as up to 8,500-pound Class MK-82 JDAM GPS-guided bombs or 16,2400-pound B-83 nuclear bombs. The B-2 is the only acknowledged aircraft and service that can carry large air-to-surface standoff weapons in a stealth configuration. Despite its considerable capital and operating costs, the B-2 Spirit remains a key component of the nation's long-range strike arsenal and one of the most survivable aircraft in the world. Malloy Aeronautics T-400 The Malloy Aeronautics T-400 is a revolutionary autonomous heavy-lift cargo drone that is transforming airborne logistics. With the ability to lift up to 180 kilograms, 400 pounds, in all weather conditions, the T-400 is designed to deliver heavy and difficult payloads anytime, anywhere. It features removable batteries that can be easily lifted by personnel, eliminating the need to wait hours to recharge. The T-400 has redundant avionics, drive, and battery systems, allowing you to focus on the task at hand rather than the vehicle. It's capable of delivering food, water, goods, medical supplies, clothing, parts, equipment, fuel, weapons, ammunition, and almost anything that troops would need on the battlefield. The T-400 is a game changer in the field of airborne logistics, offering a high level of automation and ease of use. China Future Stealth Drone China is making significant advancements in military technology with the development of stealth drones. The Tianying Skyhawk, a stealthy unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, has recently undergone upgrades that have enhanced its stealth characteristics and endurance. The Skyhawk features a flying wing design, similar to the USB-2 Spirit, which gives it advanced stealth capabilities. It's designed to operate in hostile environments, serving as a force multiplier for the People's Liberation Army Air Force by facilitating stealth penetration and precision attack missions. Another stealth drone, the Gongi 11, was revealed in a Chinese National Day Parade, showcasing a blended wing-body stealth exterior similar in design construction to an RQ-170 Sentinel stealth drone. These developments in stealth drone technology demonstrate China's commitment to enhancing its military capabilities and presence on the global stage. Anti-tank missiles Anti-tank guided missiles, ATGMs, are a crucial part of modern warfare designed to hit and destroy heavily armored military vehicles. They range in size from shoulder-launched weapons, which can be transported by a single soldier, to larger tripod-mounted weapons, which require a squad or team to transport and fire. ATGMs have been developed by numerous countries, each with their unique models. Some of the world's deadliest anti-tank missiles include the AGM-114R, Spike, Javelin, and Red Arrow. These missiles provide armed forces with the capability to stop a heavily armored tank in its tracks. The evolution of ATGMs has significantly enhanced the battlefield capabilities of light infantry, giving them a real chance against post-war tank designs. Saab JAS-39 Gripen the Saab JAS-39 Gripen, also known as the Griffin, is a light single-engine supersonic multi-role fighter aircraft manufactured by the Swedish aerospace and defense company Saab AB. The Gripen, which has a delta wing and canard configuration, is designed with relaxed stability and fly-by-wire flight controls. It was developed to replace the Saab 35 Draken and 37 Viggen in the Swedish Air Force. The first flight took place in 1988, and it entered service with the Swedish Air Force in 1996. 
the Gripen E-Series, a new fighter aircraft system developed to counter and defeat advanced future threats, features advanced electronic warfare with spherical coverage, the latest AESA technology for high survivability, and an intuitive HMC with AI, enabling the pilot to make quick and correct decisions. GM-6 Lynx The GM-6 Lynx is a unique, multi-purpose sniper rifle that combines the strengths of sniper rifles, combat rifles, and anti-material weapons. It's designed for use by land, air, territorial, and independent armed forces. The GM-6 Lynx is capable of destroying key pinpoint targets, armored rifle troops and vehicles, light shelters and buildings, radio electronic construction, missile launchers up to 2,000 plus meters distance, and hovering helicopters within a 600 to 800 meters shooting range. It generates significantly greater muzzle energy than conventional small arms. The GM-6 Lynx is lightweight and features an ultra-low recoil, making it possible to shoot in a standing position. It also offers tool-free disassembling, taking less than 3 minutes for disassembling and reassembling. F-35 Lightning the Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II is an American family of single-seat, single-engine, all-weather stealth, multi-role combat aircraft. It's designed to perform both air superiority and strike missions while also providing electronic warfare and intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities. The F-35 has three main variants, the conventional takeoff and landing, CTOL, F-35A, the short takeoff and vertical landing, Stavl, F-35B, and the carrier-based, CV slash Catabar, F-35C. Despite criticism for its size, complexity, and cost, the F-35 is planned to be a cornerstone of NATO and U.S. Allied air power until 2070. Bundeswehr's Bridge Lay The Bundeswehr's Bridge Layer, known as the Laguan, is an impressive piece of military engineering. Capable of transporting and laying one bridge in the military load class MLC-80, about 72 tons, with a length of 26 meters, or alternatively two bridges each 14 meters long, all under combat conditions. This modern bridge layer, weighing in at 63 tons, ensures that Bundeswehr's combat vehicles can move freely, even in densely packed forests. The Laguan lays its 35-meter bridge horizontally using a free cantilever system, making it hard to detect. With 80% of its operation automated, an experienced crew can lay the bridge in just 6 minutes. This capability significantly enhances the Bundeswehr's ability to ford water and cross gaps in terrain, even with heavy equipment. It's a testament to the power of engineering and innovation in modern warfare. Elbit Systems Lanius Elbit Systems Lanius is a highly maneuverable and versatile drone-based loitering munition designed for short-range operation in urban environments. As part of the Legion X robotic combat solution, Lanius can autonomously scout and map buildings and points of interest for possible threats, detecting, classifying, and syncing to Elbit Systems Legion X solutions. It can carry lethal or non-lethal payloads, capable of performing a broad spectrum of mission profiles for special forces, military, law enforcement, and HLS. The system incorporates algorithms using image processing to identify points of interest and displays relevant data and identification information to the operator. EATEC OGL the EATEC on Gun Laser OGL, is a high performance, compact laser sight designed for professional use. It's powered by a single CR-123 battery, providing up to 9 hours of continuous run time. The OGL is similar in size to a standard deck of playing cards, making it extremely portable and convenient. It features an all-aluminum housing for extreme durability. 
The OGL comes with both visible green and IR aiming lasers, as well as an IR illuminator. The IR illuminator uses a high-performing vertical cavity surface emitting laser, VCSEL, diode, which creates a clean beam and allows for quick adjustments from spot to flood. The OGL also has a unique ergonomic lever that allows professionals to adjust their illumination needs instantly, maintaining superior situational awareness.